family murder case inspired him to become part of the force? Oh, really? Indeed, he just got promoted to police constable in Winnipeg. Fancy that. Huh. Perhaps we'll be on the same case someday, who knows? I hope so. Any mail for Bloom Police Station? Box 5? That's us. Thanks. Okay, goodbye. Hello, town of Bloom, who may I connect you with? Hello, this is Portage La Prairie train station. I'm looking to connect with the staff sergeant of Bloom Police Station. Actually, the staff sergeant is off duty at the moment, but I can connect you with Sergeant Basil Johnson. That's fine. One moment, please. Pam, that number is the police station. Oh, Peggy, Mr. Johnson is right over there. Oh. Basil, I think Peggy's waving at you. Oh, you better go see what it's about. That was fast. Who am I speaking with? Sir, this is Mr. Kellington of the Canadian Pacific Railway Station at Portage La Prairie. I'm just calling regarding a young woman who's traveled from Winnipeg wishing to speak with a police officer in Bloom about a matter of great importance. All right, where is she now? A local RCMP officer from Portage is driving her your way as we speak. Her name is Minnie Breyer, by the way. She's been told to arrive at the general store, as I'm aware that's the most central meeting place in your town. It is indeed. Well, Mr. Kellington, thank you for your call. Best wishes, Mr. Johnson. To you as well. Bye now. Thanks, Peg. I just got a call from Minnie Breyer? Yes, that's me. That was fast. Sergeant Johnson, miss. Er, Sergeant Detective Basil Johnson. It's nice to meet you. I need your help, Detective Johnson. You two look a lot alike. Yes, we're twins. So, you say that your sister usually visits on Sundays, correct? Yes, sir. But this past Sunday she failed to show up. That's right. It's been three days and I still haven't heard from her. Even Mum hasn't heard anything, and a letter from May usually gets delivered each Monday, ever since May took that job at the Thompsons last spring. Strange. We're all so worried about her. I hate to think anything untoward happened. May has written to us about her friends from town and the things they get up to. I'm worried they got her into something- Illegal? Well, I don't think I'd go as far as to say illegal, but definitely something inappropriate. I see. So, you say that your sister is 18, but she doesn't live in the family home? No. She moved out as soon as she turned 18. It's been about a year now since she left. She got an opportunity to make money by herself, and ever since she's become more and more of a stranger to us. What about your parents? Are they coming to Bloom? Ever since that farmhouse burned down ten years ago, my parents haven't been able to set foot in Bloom. They were close with the Lockwoods, and it still hurts. Dad died shortly after the incident, so it's just Mom now. And Mom 
doesn't like trains, so it falls to me to come to Bloom and discover what happened to May. I'm sorry to hear about your father. Perhaps that could explain why May left. Anyways, you said your sister worked for the Thompsons. I'll give them a call and see if they can come down and speak to me. Hello, Sergeant Johnson speaking. Yes, passing through. Hello, Mr. Bennett. This is Sergeant Basil Johnson. Yes, I'm coming right away. Thank you, Mr. Bennett. I think I may have a lead on your sister. This is Inspector Buchanan. How can I assist you? Hello, Inspector Buchanan. This is Sergeant Basil Johnson of the Bloom Police Department. I got your name referred to me by Walter Brown. I'm in need of your assistance. Figured as much. What can I help you with? There's been an accident in Bloom, and a young girl appears to have died. I'm one man short, as Brown's wife has just gone into labor. Would you be able to come to Bloom to assist me in the investigation? That sounds suspicious. I haven't been to Bloom in... About ten years. Give me a second to check my calendar. Yes, I believe I should be able to do that. I'll be down right away. I'll see you soon, Sergeant Johnson. Thank you so much, Inspector. My pleasure. I'll be on a train tonight. Goodbye, Johnson. Bloom.